The natural world is an incredible teacher, so I love to seek out both the everyday and the truly bizarre to feed my curiosity. I'm Katie Dyka, and I'm a surface designer specializing in patterns inspired by nature. I've worked with women's wear brands like Chadwick's of Boston, Coldwater Creek, and Talbot's. I've also participated in projects with the interior fabrics company Fabrica, including a collaboration with Iris Atfell. My passion for entomology was nurtured in a little natural history museum where I worked as a student and returned later on as a curator. There I learned to pin and care for insect specimens. It's that connection between science and art that really gets me excited and inspires my pattern design. I like to think of surface design as the point where fine art meets commercial design. I especially love it when clients let me sneak insects and other creatures into otherwise unsuspecting prints. I find joy in the details, whether it's going out of my way to preserve rough edges or incorporate a perfectly imperfect texture. In this Domestica course, you'll learn how to create textile motifs inspired by nature using gouache and Photoshop. For the final project, you'll have your repeating pattern printed either on fabric or directly onto a garment using an online service. First, I'll introduce you to surface design, printing methods, and types of patterns we see in nature. We'll also make an inspiration board. Next, we'll experiment with mark making using some unconventional objects. After selecting the colors and scale, we'll paint our motifs. We'll digitize our artwork and design our repeat. We'll simplify our palette and create multiple colorways. Last of all, I'll help you conceive coordinating prints and get them manufactured online. As a bonus, we'll look at ways to turn your artwork into digital wallpaper. By the end of this course, you'll be able to observe, interpret, and translate nature into unique custom pieces. To follow my steps, you will need gouache, paint brushes, and some unconventional mark making tools like feathers, pine cones, and bamboo skewers. If nature can create patterns without even trying, then with a little effort, so can you. 